Welcome to NHL 21. Today we're going to learn how to skate faster. It all starts with, you know, having the puck. So here we get a player with control of the puck right there. And uh, what he's going to do to skate faster is he's going to push in the left analog stick as a button. And then while he's doing that, he's holding it down to accelerate right there. Let's get the zoom out a little bit. And as you can see, he's skating fast. Now, if you'll notice, he turns over the puck. Now, fortunately, very fortunately for him right here, he gets control of the puck again. Uh, that's one of the downsides of skating uh, faster is that you lose control of the puck. So here he's skating again here and uh, doing the same thing, pushing in the left analog stick and just going as fast as we can, skating fast. And all he does is get touched just a little bit right there, just a little bit and lose control of the puck. Now, fortunately, again, he happens to be skating faster than the other player here going around the goal. And he's able to get by uh, the defender there. Let's zoom out a little bit. And if you'll notice, again, holding the left analog stick in. But yeah, like what I said, one of the problems with that is you can turn over the puck quite a bit. And we get really lucky here. We're able to get our player in position. He's not skating fast. Makes a little move around the defender. Find some space. All right. Take the right analog stick. Push it back. And then push it up. Aiming for the top left-hand corner there. And uh, get a nice uh, slap shot goal right there. Okay. Going to learn a few tricks on how to skate faster. First off... We don't want to skate fast with these players around us or we'll lose control of the puck. So what we're going to do is we are going to hold down the right analog stick to the right and just do a little deke. Try to buy a little time. Uh, once we're even with them or we got some space, which we do right here, we're going to push in the left analog stick or L3, push it in like a button. And if you'll notice, he's starting to accelerate right there. If you'll also notice, he does not have good control of the puck. That's something we'll touch on a little bit later here. But as you can see, skating really, really fast uh, around the outside there. And if you'll notice right here, because he does not have control of the puck, skating fast, a little bit of contact, and he loses control of the puck. Now, fortunately for us, we were headed in the right di direction. We didn't get knocked over, so we still have control of the puck. Here we are going to push in the left analog stick and hold it down as a button. And skating fast again. And unfortunately... We run into another guy right here, and again, we just don't have control of the puck. Now, we get lucky in this spot right here, and we get another player that uh, takes control of the puck right there. And uh, we're able to get a nice open lane, and we uh, take the right analog stick, push it back. And we're going to aim for the top left-hand corner, and then we push the right analog stick up right there for a nice uh, wide open uh, slap shot into the goal. In this spot right here, we're going to talk a little bit about using puck control and uh, speed boost. As you can see, we're skating around in our zone right here. What we're looking to do is get a spot where we can find a speed boost and get out of here. If you'll notice, this defender is keying in on our right shoulder. That means we're taking the left analog stick right there and turning, pushing it down and around uh, to spin around to the right. So we spin around to the right right there. Right about here. This is where we push the left analog stick in. If you'll notice, he doesn't have control of the puck. That's one of the things about using the speed boost is you do not have control of the puck. But we've got space, and we're able to create some separation. Going for the corner, there's another player right there. We get just enough to get by him. And uh, finally, uh, we get hit there, but uh, we keep control of the puck. And we're able to uh, get off a nice uh, wrist shot, quick wrist shot right there for a nice uh, empty net goal right there. And, of course, that is going to wrap this up. I am signing out. If you're looking for more tips on NHL 21, there is a link in the description below to a playlist. Or you can check out the playlist on this channel. There should be an NHL 21 tips playlist on there. And uh, I'm also going to try to drop a link in the comments section as well, just in case... You miss on the first two. So anyway, uh, that is going to ramp this up. I am signing out. Thanks for watching and good luck.